this um, handle here gets really really warm um, when the fire is on of course and since you have to since I have to open this uh, little door to feed the fire with firewood um, it's a little bit you know sometimes it's a bit difficult to open it and I don't really want to use pot handles uh, because those are for the kitchen so I thought I'm gonna make um, I'm gonna make a pot handle so this is what I would like to do this was uh, gifted to me by a friend um, I really like it I don't really like this pink color but the rest I kind of really like it it's I think it's I believe it's wool it feels like wool but I don't know actually but I would like to make another one of these and I'm using this yarn that I have um, from my stash and I'm trying to crochet it. I'm using a crochet hook. I actually really like crochet. It's not knitting. Like knitting is my favorite craft, but I'm trying to to crochet this uh, pot handle or this, you know, this thing. How do you call this? Pot handles, right? Uh, so you don't burn yourself when you pick up something that is uh, super hot. Um, so I am too lazy to check a tutorial online. So I'm gonna, and I know that that will backlash on me, but I want to try to, <laughs> you know, create it out of my own crazy logic and it's not because I'm stubborn it's mostly because I don't really want to bother to you know follow a tutorial um, but it would probably backlash on me and then I will have to rip it back and you know like frog it and then start it over and time is lost but I'm going to take the risk and uh, yeah so I'm trying to crochet in the round I don't know how this will end up okay so I have done the like a quite medium sized circle uh, but it has this <laughs> it has this bump in the center but I think it's gonna be okay um, it's gonna be okay I'm gonna felt it and we'll see how we look then <laughs> let's see if I will burn myself in real time <laughs> Then I can keep working and finishing this beauty here. I'm so looking forward to have it done. And then I'll have to continue another whip. So for tonight, for this evening, I'm busy and I can enjoy a nice, you know, something, watching something while I'm working and it feels cozy and nice and I'm drinking some fennel tea from this cute little mug I got it um, in a second-hand store I love this mug because it has a lid and I never owned 
I never owned a, a mug with a lid. I always thought that it would be beautiful and super useful to have a lid because it remains warmer longer than you know if it didn't have the lid and you can also place the uh, tea bag on the lid if you don't want it to have it inside so this is a beautiful handmade cup and I love it gonna have it here yeah so this is the result I'm really about to I'm just gonna finish it now and then I'm thinking to felt it because then it will co give a little bit more coverage it's fine because the whole cloth can. Um, as you can see from my face, I'm feeling so exhausted and tired. So I'll spend the rest of the evening just relaxing and knitting. And uh, let me know if you like this type of a bit of, you know, peek at my everyday lifestyle type of videos um yeah this video was a bit a bit of mix matched of things um i planned to do a recipe videos but then i i had other things to do I had friends they came to visit so i just i know it's it's a freestyle it's a wild video um, welcome <laughs> to this wild <laughs> channel um, but yeah if you would like more information about this recipe I'll uh, do a better video or I'll send you more information about it and uh, otherwise if you like this type of videos a bit to kind of improvised thing whatever it is um, just let me know I really much enjoy to bring you sometimes or bring the camera uh, and therefore maybe you that you're watching with me um, on foraging walk and things and my daily lifestyle but I know that maybe it's not super interesting for everyone so um, yeah just let me know and uh, we'll see what we can do uh, yeah it's evening here so I'm just going to to relax a bit and uh, thank you so much for being here with us and with me I hope you're having great time and uh, see you next time stay wild